Hey guys, Dr. Sandy here from uh, Calgary. I apologize in advance for the noise. I'm just up in my hotel and I just wanted to uh, still make a video for you guys. So one thing I was going to talk about as well, and I thought this was powerful, uh, I do so much reading and I always want to share whatever I'm learning with you guys, is what is your objective? Now obviously a lot of people have an objective like to lose weight, uh, make more money, uh, great relationship and all this stuff. And I, I read something so powerful about goal setting because I always refine and I'm always thinking how we can do things better. And then I was reading about this lady who was saying that, you know what, what is your end state? So is the goal to have tons of money and that's nice and everything but what is your end state do you want to feel peace do you want to feel relaxed so add that to your goal of course move in a positive direction of course you want to get healthier you want to be better financially you want to have better relationships but ask yourself that question that what is the end state that i should be feeling how do i know when i've arrived and of course you never arrive we're always refining but how do i know if i've arrived so if you want to lose maybe the weight the goal would be that you'd feel good about yourself you'd be happy you'd be relaxed focus on of course losing the weight but make sure you encompass that in the goal financially I'd like that well-being so that I'd be at peace I'd be less stressed I know it'd be good for my health make sure that's part of the goal as well so look at that emotional end state as well and focus on that and another recommendation I would have is that let's say that ultimately your long-term goal is that financial well-being so I can have that uh, state of peace on a micro level you start to do things daily that like if you listen to your favorite song if you meditate if you pray uh, if you read an inspirational quote it gives you that peace you're training your mind to go into that direction you're going in that direction you're practicing that habit you're making those neural connections and you're getting closer to that state because sometimes in life you can have a goal you achieve it you know I need to make a million bucks uh, lose the 10 pounds whatever you achieve it and a lot of people are like is that it what's the point so I think have the objective goal but have that emotional side as well and when you combine them together it'll be powerful so God bless you guys I'll be back in uh, Toronto next week and wish you all the best thank you